five men danced on a hill, and on that hill, four men lay. Which man was it? Was Isaac wearing a wig? Maggie time. Let's do it. Oh, wait. Don't you dare run into me, you sons of bitches. They thought about doing it. They thought about doing it. They thought the whole time they were going to be like, I'm going to hit this motherfucker. They're not going to hit this motherfucker. This motherfucker's name is Maggie. The slowest character in the game. As slow as molasses. And you know what? Molasses and Magdalene? Same amount of letters. They both start with M. What does that say? It says that Magdalene is molasses. And what, what do we like about molasses? Molasses is sweet. It's, it's, it's delicious. It's great in combination with other foods. I would really like this guy. He's gonna die in the next hit. That's all right. I would I would have really liked to have used him to blow this up, but that's fine. Uh, I'm not going to take that. I'm gonna be a smart boy and not take that yet. I'm gonna go back to old school Isaac, Isaac like not Isaac theory. Isaac uh, min maxing. Isaac meta. That's the word I'm looking for. Isaac meta. Old school Isaac meta. Don't take soul hearts on the first floor until you've gone to your curse room and fought your boss. Why? Because then you can preserve your best chances of getting a deal on the next floor. Simple, simple math. Don't take it. We got three going down to the next floor. We got... We got the infestation. It's pretty bad. You know what's even worse is this room. Because I think... The way that it works, we're going to actually pick up that other soul heart on the way. <gasps> oh. I knew we were going to do it. Son of a bitch. I knew that was going to happen. I should have pushed it out of the way with some kind of mental gymnastics. There's no no way to do that. But Oh, God. So, inf ooh, infestation sucks. Uh, it's not a good item. Same room, almost. Pooters are in a different vicinity. I'll fight the boss first. Is Monstro. I may just take a couple hits here to speed up the fight. I know that sounds really dumb. But I, it sped up the fight like basically nil. But you know what? It's all right. How many? We got we got red hearts laying around. Let's get hit a couple more times. It doesn't. It's not guaranteed to spawn flies every time. That's why infestation is one of the worst items in the game. Uh, it's basically everything you like about Mulligan except backwards and not useful at all. Uh, so basically, this is why I'm going to struggle so much to get our blue candle to leave the floor because blue candle's actually really good. Please give me bombs. That's... The Fool Fudge. There's no curse room? Eh. Game! Why do you not have a curse room for me? I could risk the secret room. But this is the... Fuck, where is it? It's... it's... I'm gonna have to deductive reasoning here. Hold on. No, it's... Just drop me four pennies. Oh, he's done it. He's actually the best Isaac player in existence. Don't accidentally buy anything else. Get the freaking candle. There it is. It's done. We've achieved happiness. We still have infestation, but I would rather... I would trade an item room being awful uh, for a shot speed upgrade in the form of the... Yay! In the form of, uh... Magic 8-Ball. <laughs> and then, uh... And also getting the... Yo! I cannot believe it, even though I can, because it was... It was bound to happen. Blue Candle, man! Blue Candle hype! Ooh! Ooh! Interesting. Interesting. I have an idea. You're gonna like my idea, trust me. Oh, this was... Oh, 
that was just the tastiest defeat. Wait, watch this. Oh, got him. Three whole keys. Three tasty keys for this boy. Oh my god. Touch me. Alright, we're gonna go up here. That's... It's not what I wanted, man. Full card out. I was really hoping that there was gonna be a freaking Bomb. To blow up that... I will go back in there. I prioritize stone chests far more than I probably should. I will definitely... Oh, what is this? I will definitely be going back in there. There you go! Alright, let's do it. So we're gonna take us down to one soul art here. That's worth it. Whatever's in here is gonna be worth it, so. Hey, Quaz. That's worth it. We're just gonna pocket that for now. No need to rush through uh, getting rid of it. It's definitely a good rune to have in your pocket if you're not in need of carrying anything else. Alright, so we're gonna sneak through there and gotta do one of these. I will go in here. Ooh. Buy this. And buy. Ah, yeah, we're gonna buy the bomb just in case. We might need the bomb. I like having bombs. I like having at least some consumables. And the game has seen fit to give me basically none on these last couple runs, so I will take it. There you go. It's an additional scent. And you are just melted. Give me something decent. I'm not going to take it yet. Ooh. Hematomesis. Speed up. It's fine. I'm actually just not going to take this. Here's what we're going to do. This is exactly what I was hoping to have happen. Because we can go back and grab the D100. Because right now we've got a shot speed upgrade and a useless freaking infestation. Which I do not like at all. So we're going to take this. We're going to leave. Because D100 does not re-roll anything outside of the room. We're going to go re-roll ourselves as well as the lunch. And the lunch is going to turn into something. I really don't care what it turns into as long as our two items get somewhat upgraded. SMB Superfan and an HP as well as a range upgrade. Totally, absolutely worthwhile. And then we can go back and grab Blue Candle. See? There's a speed upgrade as Maggie, a tears upgrade as Maggie, a damage upgrade as Maggie, HP and luck upgrade as Maggie. It's a double luck upgrade, I believe. No, SMB Superfan doesn't give you a luck up. But anyway, it's a good addition to our run right now. Does it make us slow down quite a bit? Yeah, because we're on downpour one at eight minutes. That's very slow. I understand this. But we're not going to boss rush. We don't give a damn about Bob Ross. You know what we do give a damn about? Not even Bob... Well, maybe. It's okay. Shoot it. Why? Because reasons and science. And science and reasons. Uh, darkness. Downpour. God darn it. Always gotta be the downpour darkness. It's my favorite indie group. The downpour of darkness. Give it a day. Dude, perish. Thank you. Ooh, the sweet baby golden key. My god, you're giving me a golden key right on the first room of combat? Shoot! And a bombzito? Oh my god. Thank you for the consumables. I appreciate it. Mm. 
I mean, like, Bob is worth it, but our tier rate's pretty high. So I'm going to take Big Fan. Big Fan's good. Net worth. Or, uh, net gain, not net worth. Net gain. Fly through the fire and the flames and carry on! You bitch. I'm not gonna go... Eh, I mean, we might as well. We have infinite money. And by infinite money, I mean infinite keys. Similar, similar things, honestly. Honestly. Alright. That's another speed upgrade. A huge deal. That's a huge deal. There's a not another teen movie reference there. That's a huge bitch. She's wearing a Tetris dress. Left hand blue. So good. Uh, I don't give a damn if you like that movie or not. It's a good movie. It's a good movie. It's a cheesy movie. Captain America wears a banana on his dick, which is uh probably the highlight of the movie and of his and of Chris Evans' career. Honestly, let's go grab our knife piece for no reason. Doesn't doesn't even matter on this run. How does it feel to be a freaking rainmaker who gets? Well, you know what? I shouldn't have gotten cocky that soon. I deserved it. I deserved it. I deserved to get slapped on the mouth there for a little bit. Uh, what I was going to say was, uh, how does it feel to be a Rainmaker who gets killed by a guy who's using fire, but... Rainmaker, uh... Had other plans for me. He... He... Get out of here. Drunk-ass bats. Flipping and flopping and... Alright, there you go. Hey, you can't just... No. Okay, listen here. Listen here. I always get... If I don't kill these guys, like, within the first second, I always get hit by their neck. Because they just... They shoot their freaking faces out. Like their goddamn Nicolas Cage and face off. It's not at all what happened in that movie, but regardless. That's so good. That's a great curse room. Contract from below. The game knows that I don't like having pupils. I haven't liked having pupils since I was a kid. Sure, we'll just go here. Yeah! So good. You asshole. Get out of here, greed. He's super greedy. I wish I would have gotten an actual shop there, but at the same time, I'm real not too disappointed. You fart! You freaking... <sighs> Little dumpies. Oh my god, dumpy. Little cock sneeze, get out of here. <sighs> You're everything that's wrong with the world. It's the worst enemy. They were designed to kill me. But hey, at least we got to use uh, Jacob's Ladder on the last run. That was nice. Definitely, definitely something that I was hope one of the one of the few items that I was definitely hoping to. Uh, get to use here uh, shortly. God damn, my brain is dying. It is late. Probably, probably part of it. Probably part of it. Probably a part of it. Probably part of it. Probably. Probably part of it. Probably. Enunciate, Penta. Enunciate. Use your lips. Use your lips. Big fan. There you go. Big fan of big fan. <sighs> Double Aquas. A 
I mean, I'm not gonna donate yet. I plan on it. I swear. I do. I'm not just saying that, like, some two-bit celebrity that is trying to impress his woman. Or man, I don't judge. This room was designed by 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 the world's greatest masochists. The little Steven, you're not doing dick right now. I'm just not. I'm not even gonna put put. I'm not even gonna say anything. You're not. You're not doing dick, my friend. Are you even? I don't even want it. I don't even want it. Get out of here. That's the floor. It's a horrible miss. Speed upgrade. Sure. Angel deal. Yes. So much. Yes. Every yes. A whole world full of yeses. You know that movie with uh, Paul Rudd? Is that his name? Paul Rudd? Whatever his name is. The Yes Man movie? Is that Paul Rudd and... Uh... The fuck is his name? Not Kevin James. It's the guy from How I Met Your Mother. Now, my, now I'm actually... My brain is actually dying. I will take this for the flight. I'm not happy about the Eternal Heart, but I will take it for the flight. In fact, I'm so upset about the Eternal Heart, I'm gonna come down here and do that. Just so I don't have to watch the damn animation when I leave the floor. Dude, Jacob's Ladder is going to get us an angel deal on the beginning of each floor. That's huge. It's guaranteed angel rooms for the rest of the run. We'll take this. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. There it is. That's all I needed in my life. I actually thought he died. I actually thought he died. That's my bad. Anyway. It's not like we need coverage on our hearts anyway right now. Mm. Of course it's Curse of the Freaking Giant. Of course it's a room with little dumpies. Oh, you fuckers. You fuckers, get out of here. Little Stevie, you gotta do something, bud. There you go. Blue map, Bogo Bombs. Perfect. And this because reasons. Hold on. Hold on. There's gotta be a there's gotta be a science here, right? Like that. I missed. Hold on. I cannot believe that hit me. But that's fine. Of course it was the champion that knocked me in the bosom. Broken mirror. Sure. Actually, I'm one of the very few that actually like Broken Mirror. I know it's a polarizing item. I actually enjoy this item. It's got some really strange synergies and some really good synergies, but a lot of people don't give it the credit it deserves. I would play you for a trinket, but I don't honestly care right now. Uh, I actually don't care about anything else on this floor. I care about one thing and one thing alone, and that's hitting you with the candle. Or missing you with the candle. Both of them work. So 
suck a dick. Fallen. I'm not even gonna candle you. Just die. Missing poster. Or missing page, excuse me. Let's just leave. I'm s I'm, I'm done with the Curse of the Giant depths. We got what we wanted. We got what we needed. Let's get what we... Oh, okay. I mean, yeah. There's no reason not to take it. I can't reroll anything, so... This Trinity Shield is so good, man. That was really dumb. I was trying to get him to retrace his steps over it. What you do? Small rock. Damn it. Magic mush, baby. Hell, any of the mushrooms I'd take at this point. My oh. <laughs> you shouldn't have. I don't even care that I'm Are You a Wizard right now. Little Steven's gonna do his work for me, buddy. I can't believe I didn't take damage sooner on that. We'll go left first. Left is gonna give us a uh, super secro. Demon! Thank you. Ah, it's a womb room. Magic mush. Still not as good as people think it is. But I will always be happy to see it. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh! The sickest of plays you've never seen. Still really slow on this run, but that's fine. When you're doing the downpour and downpour two, the runs are not going to be very fast. People are like, well, do you miss Bosch Rush because you're so slow? And I'm like, no, I miss Bosch Rush. Bosch, Bosch Rush. I miss Bob Ross. Uh, this is why I call it Bob Ross, because I can't talk. Uh, I miss Bob Ross because the freaking game, the anti-birth uh, floors add so much to the damn game that it's easy to miss because it adds like an it adds an additional floor so you're not not only are you rushing to get to boss rush but you're double rushing to get through the downpour and downpour too that's it that's, and that's saying if you don't even do the mines i will play this fortune teller i don't know why i said that's a weird fortune teller go down baby there you go. Curved Horn Cancer. Curved Horn Cancer. Curved Horn Cancer. Death is fine. Actually, death might be over. Ah, Birkenau's good. Song of the Siren is so good. That's so good. That actually might be our best, because that's going to make Steven shoot so fast. That's actually, like, I... I'll go down to like 30 cents or until it blows up. Just to see if it gives me a curved horn or a cancer, which is all I'm gonna take now. I suppose we could also get cards and stuff from it too. Lucky Rock isn't what we need. Devil, devil I'll take. Use this just in case it's a crawl space. It's not. I actually have no more shops, so. Yeah, that's that's all we're gonna do. Bomb this boy. Bomb this boy. Bomb this boy. So good. Many thank yous. Many donkas. Song of the Siren is gonna make Steven MVP status. It's gonna make him fire twice as fast. He's gonna be firing as fast as me. Well, maybe not as fast as me, but he's gonna be he's gonna be firing pretty fast. That's what I'm trying to say, guys. Twice as fast. I think it's a 200% increase. And that's huge to have a 200% firing psychic familiar. Birthright! I forgot what that did with Maggie. It gave me all red HP. But why? And a discount red stew. I might take it and use it. 
because it gives you a massive damage bonus. Full HP and a damage bonus. So yeah, we're going to want to go immediately to our item room. Find our, find our, our boss fight. Yeah, we'll take this. I actually forgot what Birthright Maggie does. We'll have to research that uh, once we get to the next floor. So quickly, quickly draining here. And we win. All right, what does birthright? Plan of God. Plan of God. Anti-birth. Birthright. Maggie. Plus three HP. That's actually trash. That's fine, though. That's fine. It's not as good as it should be, but you know what? Or it's not as good as it is with the other characters. Like with, I think with with like the lost, it removes all uh, HP upgrades from the from the item pools, which makes you know the lost substantially better to play as because you're not going to be getting like lunches and crap. Oh, 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 candle, shout candle. Every room cleared without taking damage increases your tier stat by one. Stupidly good. Stupidly, stupidly, stupidly good. It's going to be good in combination with the red stew. Assuming I can prevent myself from taking the damage that I'm an idiot and normally do take. Uh, even with our damage raised uh, or gone back down to normal, we're going to be at like 10 or something, I think. No, we're not going to be at 10. But even even with the red stew running out, which I thought it was an active item, it's not though, which is a huge deal. Uh, I'll take Aquarius. I'll definitely take Aquarius here. Hell yeah. Does Pashel Candle cross the cap, though? I don't remember. Yeah, 6.89 for our damage. That's not terrible. And fucking and Broken Mirror doing some serious work here as well. Hella good. Hella, hella, hella good. There you go. Do you go... Below the cap. You do get going to minus four. So good. So good. Hey, man. No sausage. Disappointed. But you know what? It's all K. It's all K. It's not okay. It's all K. It was a very well played room. I'm not gonna feel bad about giving myself a little, little tap on the shoulder over that one. That was a really well played room. That was really dumb to go in here though. Wouldn't hurt to get a couple more damage upgrades though, to really capitalize on the Pashal Candle. To really just like grind it home a little bit. Because we got Blue Candle as well. Which is going to do its own freaking thing. We still got our Rotten Heart. Crafting us some fantastic ass familiar boys here. He's dead. I'm going to just take it. Tears and damage up. It's alright. Speed down, but we've gotten a couple of speed upgrades, so it's not going to hurt us too bad. We're going to be at 1.75 still. Not terrible at all. This is a good room. This is a good Maggie run. It's become an even better Maggie run with the wafer uh, stacking on top of us. We still have the varicose veins, which I'm still gonna always call the varicose veins. I know it's called the the voodoo pin, I think, in in anti birth. But after playing Afterbirth Plus for 200 plus episodes, it's just varicose veins to me. It's 200 plus episodes plus like 56 plus million hours on stream. It's always just gonna be varicose veins to me. Which was hilarious because the first time I got varicose veins in in Afterbirth Plus, you know, as with most of the Afterbirth Plus editions, I was like, this is just a stupid freaking anti-birth ripoff. 
they took this from Antibirth. And then after a while, I was just like, I'm just going to call it what it is. It's varicose veins. I'm glad when they put the freaking backpack or the school bag in there, they didn't call it something different. I think they just still kept that as a school bag, which was a nice little touch that they were just like, we're not going to change the name of this one. We're just going to call it what it is. So let me know what you guys think in the comments. Like, what do you what what is your opinion on the broken mirror? Because it's a real polarizing item. Fifty percent of people hate it. Fifty percent of people love it. I'm in team. I love the broken mirror. Don't get hit. There you go. Keep that Pashal candle going. Heading on up. Go to our next angel deal. Maybe we'll get a sacred heart play. Please. Please. Give me a sacred heart, baby. I want my sacred heart, daddy. There's a halo. It's decent. It's going to drop us to... 9 point something? 9.7. Because i got to keep in mind that we do have our damage multiplier from Magic Mush. So all of the damage multiplier or damage ups that I have been getting, I've been undervaluing, I think. Which is which is normal. Yeah. I mean, actually Mongo Baby's like really good too. Cause it's Song of the Siren, double little Steven. That's like insanely good. Double Little Steven with Song of the Siren, so. We basically got 2 to two x Little Steven right now. Firing at twice the fire rate. I am not mad about doing this room. I believe he's buffed by Song of the Siren. It seems like he is, but it's hard to tell. He, Yeah, he definitely is. He definitely is. And if he's not, that's bullshit, and I'm going to call you on your, your your nonsense game. But he should be. He, he should definitely be. Excuse you? You cockswoggler. You broke my Pashal candle, man. I'm only firing at max normal fire rate. <laughs> Oh, that candle missed just barely. It's all right. I should not have been hit there, but that's all good. Guess we're just gonna have to build the candle back up. I mean, we we haven't been hitting like a floor and a half or two. At a certain point, you just sort of get used to not being able to take damage. Alright, I'm going to go up and left because our super secret room could have something decent in it. I'm also very interested in our uh, tinted rock back there because we still haven't gotten a small rock. If we get a small rock now, it's going to be like a plus 2.2. .2. Shitty math, real quick. Don't do math on stream. It's all good. Yeah, birthright with Maggie. I was understandably disappointed that it was a, just a plus three HP. I think I re vaguely remember that being the case, and I was just like, oh, come on, man, come on. But it's all good, though. All right. Isaac, you dick. Suck an egg. Ah, that was really dumb. I preemptively just walked out into him. That was real stupid. Get those... Get those varicose vein shots! It's alright. I think we're gonna fight Megastan. I think we're gonna open these... 
I'm gonna grab our useless items that we have here. We're gonna get Sacred Heart. Fuck. You could have been the one. We're just gonna fight Stan. Just gonna fight Stan. I could have taken the time to raise my tier rate. But, eh. Honestly? Yeah, I was gonna say, just honestly, at this point, just if you get hit, charge, man. Use those varicose feign shots. But yeah, let me know what you guys' opinions are on Broken Mirror. On my reflection. I call it Broken Mirror, it's my reflection. I understand. We team my we team my reflection or we team anti my reflection. I am team my reflection. I love the broken mirror. Get him. And honestly, just go. It's alright. Oh, my butt's so numb. It's that kind of numb where I'm. If you get hit, just tank it, man. If you get hit, just tank it. We got like a thousand HP. <sighs> Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, of course, you know what to do down below. My name is Penta. Show your support of the series by leaving a like and a subscribe. Let me know your comments down below. Any questions I've asked, feel free to let me know. And uh, stay tuned uh, for the next episode. We'll catch you in that one. Yeah,